to my channel. I am in a weird place today because as you guys probably know from my Instagram and Snapchats, I've lost all of my footage in Huntington Beach, literally all of it. The SD card went missing during the flight. So today I'm doing an impromptu video at the pool of the hotel I'm staying at this weekend. So this kind of worked out. I'm in a little cabana, so it's a nice little setup, I would say, but I had to figure out a way to pop the camera up. So it's literally on a table in the middle of the cabana. So let's just get right into this video. Also, don't mind all of the outside noise. I'm literally at a pool, so there's obviously other people running around the pool, and there's even people walking around. So try not to let that distract you. Okay, so when I was in Huntington Beach, I went to the Sephora Pacific City, which is a brand new shopping center. So I'm just gonna go through some of the things I bought because I know people love Sephora hauls. First thing are these Ole Henriksen wipes. I needed some makeup removing wipes because when I travel, I hate taking the cleanser, the makeup remover, the micellar water, all the cotton pads. So I just decided to go with the Grease Relief Cleansing Cloths. These smell amazing. They have botanical uh, ingredients in them, and I feel like the exfoliating side of the cloth is really, really handy if you have a lot of dry skin, and during the summer in Arizona, it's really, really hot. So this is super helpful, and then the other side of the cloth is soft. You can use that around your eyes, so I really find these super, super helpful, and there's 30 in this pack, so I think it's definitely a good deal, even though it's more on the pricey side. I needed a new foundation because the foundation I had was really bunching up right in the center of my forehead, so I went with the Dior Skin Nude Air, and I've been keeping it in here because I'm afraid that it's going to get everywhere, but it's really cool because it comes in this really pretty packaging, of course, because it's Dior, but the little pipette is so nice and this foundation feels literally like air so the name really fits it. I'm the shade 10 so it's very light but because I can contour and it's summertime it really doesn't make that big of a difference that it's just a little bit lighter than my skin but it feels amazing. It lasts a really long time and it's easily buildable. I would say this is more medium coverage but you can make it full coverage or whatever you want. And because I don't really like brushes anymore I decided to get a new beauty blender and what I like about this is that it's actually tan, so now when I put foundation on it, you won't be able to tell that it's dirty because it's just tan from the very beginning, so I really like that element to it. But there's something about a beauty blender that just works better than any of the other sponges out there. It is pricier, it's probably twice the cost of that Real Technique sponge, but it works really, really well. And you all know I have a lip addiction, so I had to get two of the Kat Von D liquid lipsticks. I don't have either one of these. And I've got the shade Mother, which is more of a pinky shade. It's not really a nude, it's a true pink. I'm wearing it on the lips right now. And then the other one was Lolita. And this is one of the most highly mentioned liquid lipsticks that I've probably ever heard of. So I think that these are both really great. But they're so long lasting, and I think they're one of the best liquid lipsticks on the market. <laughs> One of the reasons I actually went to the store is because I needed a new cleanser, something that would get all the makeup off. But this actually came as a birthday gift, so I got really lucky. It's the Fresh Soy Face Cleanser, and I just really, really like this. It works really well. It gets the makeup off. It's really exfoliating, nourishing, hydrating. Love it. And then I also picked up this Philosophy Grace little perfume as a reward perk. It smells really fresh, and it's not necessarily a cologne or one of my favorite fragrances, but it's really fresh and it's light fruity and kind of perfect for the summertime when it's probably not that appropriate to wear something that's really thick and heavy. And that is it. Those were all the things I picked up. Sorry this video is so long too. Because I lost all that footage in Huntington Beach, I had to figure out a way to make the video happen today. Thank you guys for all the new subscribers and I will see you in my next video.